Hey everybody, happy Monday. Just wanted to say hi. It's been a long time. I haven't made a video. And um, I just wanted to talk to you guys about... Uh, a lot of people ask me, how you feeling? How you doing? Um, I just wanted to talk a little bit about that. I just wanted to basically say, um, you know, it's been... You know, I'm going on to my seventh uh, week into from my surgery date and um, this week. And uh, basically, you know, I barely... I'll start with, with saying I barely eat that much anymore. Um, I really don't have an appetite at all. Um, you know, I just, uh, you know, I had a few couple weeks of, you know, I guess I was dehydrated a little bit because I wasn't able to drink all the fluids. Um, uh, I think in the beginning I was more scared just to even drink anything or if I drank something I didn't like it. So I was battling that for a while. I still am, but it's getting a little bit better with me uh, drinking fluids now. Um, I was okay with protein in the beginning, protein drinks, but now I'm like really not liking them anymore. Um, and, you know, I haven't really tried too much of solid foods yet. Uh, the other day I got to eat at, um, Famous Dave's for a few of those that's been there before to that restaurant. And I actually had a little bit of, um, their chicken there. Uh, it was like two bites of chicken and then like maybe a spoon of their, uh, beans. And then I had a few of the, um, spoons of their mashed potatoes, which was really good. Um, no, it's not the healthiest, but, um, it just felt... Like, um, you know, I got finally something in my stomach that was more on the solid side. So I only had a few spoons of that. Um, and, you know, I've had, like, tuna fish uh, with some of those, uh, like, whole wheat crackers uh, here and there. Uh, um, I take protein drinks here and there. Uh, I drink a lot of water. Water happens to be my favorite right about now. Like, I could just drink water all day long. I mean don't drink as much as I'm supposed to probably but I mean I just that's all that's refreshing to me right now I don't like any of that crystal light I mean it all has like a really bad aftertaste uh, for me um I'd rather just drink drink water so if I have to add protein at times I'll add it to like a yogurt uh I'll have yogurt uh, I haven't found a really good one yet because a lot of them have a lot of sugar um so I just, you know, I'll have a yogurt, like, you know, once every other day or so. Um, and basically just, like, water and um, cheese. Uh, I could have, like, a little bit of scrambled egg and cheese or oatmeal. If I have time to make it, I'll, I'll have something like that. Or some deli meat, turkey deli meat. And um, I have, like, I'm lucky if I got one piece. And, um... I just wanted to uh, give you guys a heads up. Uh, I'm ready to go back to the gym. So I'm going back this week. Uh, I'm hoping I'm going to go back tomorrow. Um, you know, at first I felt like a little weak and stuff because I wasn't in drinking enough fluids. So I was a little concerned about going back to the gym. And I didn't know if that, you know, I didn't want to get more dehydrated and stuff like that. And I also had one of my incisions that were opened up and... It took a few weeks for it to close up, so that's why I didn't want to, like, start exercising a little too early. I didn't want to hurt myself and then be out longer than, you know. Because um, for those that have been following my journey from the very beginning, know that uh, exercising has been a big part of it for me. Like, that's what really keeps me going. And so far, like, today I weighed myself. I'm down to 295. I still feel like my scale's broken. I told some of you guys that already. I feel like I should be in the 280s or so because, I mean, I barely eat anymore. But um, I'll know on Wednesday when I go to my nutritionist how much exactly I weigh. But as of now, it's my scale saying 295. And I'm just waiting till Wednesday because if my nutritionist scale is different, I just got to throw mine out and buy a new one or whatever. Um, and also just a reminder, I have a raffle. Um, I just felt like my page was getting a little boring. So for those of you that maybe haven't entered for some reason, um, this is open to everybody, um, that's on my page. So please, um, just take advantage of that. It's $50. I mean, you could do a lot with that money. I mean, it's just, I'm, you know, being generous and giving it away. Um, 
And I plan to do raffles uh, just because I want to keep my page as interesting as possible. I don't want my page to get boring. Um, and I just, you know, I'm going to start exercising this week. I'm going to take it light as possible. And then after that, um, you should start seeing me, you know, exercising like crazy like before. Like, once I get into it, I like to exercise like two, three times a day. I mean, I do have the time because I am not working right now. Um, and I do have some back issues. So that kind of um, at times, you know, gives me trouble. But other than that, I mean, I just want to get my motivation back. I mean... I want to be back to the old Madi you guys first met, like very energetic and just keep, you know, exercising from one place to another. So little by little, you'll start seeing, um, you know, more interesting um, videos and posts on my page because I know I'm starting to get bored myself. I mean, I'm dying to start exercising. And I just wanted to leave you guys with some motivation for today. Um, for those of you that are thinking to either do weight loss surgery or lose weight on your own, um, you know, just don't wait any longer. Uh, I mean, for me, it was to, you know, to, I felt like I was dying. That's the, the that was like my, my, start to all this I had to feel like I was dying to want to change my health and you know I mean I wish I would have done this sooner I mean and I'm talking about weight loss surgery I wish I would have done this a lot sooner in my life but you know what God has his plans and I do you know always think it's everything's in God's timing so either way um you know, like I said, if you guys want to go with weight loss surgery or you want to do it on your own, just don't wait any longer because, I mean, tomorrow's not promised to us. So whatever we have to do just to, you know, just start living a healthier life, do it, you know. I don't care, you know, which which method you choose, whatever works for you. I mean, I know this is what works for me and, you know, I uh, just want to throw something out there because I know a lot of people try to bash weight loss surgery. But, you know, if you're going to lose uh, 5 or 10 pounds or or if you want to be like me, I lost 100 pounds on my own last year. Um, I lost 100 pounds. And what happened was, you know, I gained 50 of it back before surgery because I knew I was getting surgery. So I started eating and going back to my old habits or, you know, I mean, I just started eating stuff I wasn't supposed to because I'm like, I'm not going to eat this ever again. So let me just take advantage of it. But, I mean, that's not the way to go either. But my point is that even if you do it on your on your own and, you know, you could still gain it back. I mean, people think, oh, well, with weight loss surgery, you know, you can lose it and then gain it back. You can gain it back also with you spending a whole year like I did, you know. So I just recommend that whatever you choose to do, I just recommend that you just don't wait any longer because, I mean, whether you do it on your own or you do a weight, weight loss journey, you still have to work hard to, I mean, even like me, I am I know I'm going to have to work twice as hard. I don't want to have hanging skin and stuff like that. I mean, I'm young. I mean, if you're a little older, I mean, who cares about the hanging skin? But for me that I'm only 32 years old, I'm going to work hard and I'm going to try to get as firm as I can and I don't you know even if I have to go to plastic surgery for the extra skin whatever I have to do then but my point is just don't risk your health you know um I tell this to everybody I'm you know just don't you know don't wait till tomorrow start today you know whatever you gotta do whether you gotta um you know just do it on your own or go with weight loss surgery do it don't wait any longer and um, I hope this video touches somebody out there today. Um, if you have any questions, comments, please post them. Um, and I'll get back to you. And have a great Monday. And I'll talk to you guys soon. I will start making more videos. And I hope you like this one. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.